This video is sponsored by Satyabama Institute of Science and Technology. Little Talks channel subscribe pannega, like pannega, share pannega. Hi, this is Deepika from Little Talks. In this case, we have Rakshit Shetty sir. Hi, Hi. sir. Hi. How are you doing? Good, good. Doing great. So, yeah, after a great effort of five years, Charlie is finally releasing. So, how is that feeling? Oh, it's an amazing feeling because uh, this film is very, very special to me. Yes. Uh, you know, um, the kind of experience what I've had in this film probably uh, is very unique when compared to uh, all the experiences put together, mm -hmm. uh, you know, uh, which I've had in other films. Uh, so yeah, it's it's exciting. I want. I'm waiting for uh, the on you know on June 10th when mm -hmm. the show op opens up and people start watching the film. I would like to see their reaction when they come out of the theater. So uh, how much is I mean like uh, how much connected to Dharma Rakshit Shetty is? I mean any common factor? Uh, there is there are a lot of Hell common little. factors. Okay. Yeah yeah yeah. Uh, I mean, I am an introvert too, so okay. <laughs> uh, not as much as Dharma. Okay. Uh, but uh, let's say let. Uh, at least 30 or 40 percent of him. <laughs> 30 or 40 percent. Yeah. Okay. So, like, what is that one thing you do it in life, and also you just put in uh, Dharma's character also? The, being an introvert, uh, you know. Just the introvert thing. Yeah. So I like to spend t time with myself. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, whenever I have uh, free time, I don't go out with friends or something, anything. Oh. I stay home and you know stay alone. I I like that uh, personal time. Okay. Uh, but Dharma does that because he doesn't want friendship. He doesn't like friends. He doesn't like uh, uh, his neighbors. He doesn't mm -hmm. want to mingle with anyone. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah. So yeah, I mean, uh, like, okay. Uh, so Rakshit Shetty is a dog lover. Uh, no. Uh, yeah, yeah, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing <laughs> okay. a dog film, so obviously. Uh -uh. No, I can't be. A, I mean, who 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 is not a dog lover? I mean, they can't. There can't be dog haters at least. For okay. Sure. Yeah. See, uh, when I was a kid, uh, I had two dogs mm -hmm. and. Uh, I think when I was in third standard one passed away, when I was in sixth, the second one passed away. Oh. And after that I have not ha had a very personal relationship uh, with, with dogs. Okay. Uh, also I probably, you know, after uh, my uh, 12th, I moved out of uh, house because mm -hmm, I mm -hmm. went to hostel and then I came to Bangalore. So mm. obviously, uh, you know, uh, my hometown had dogs, mm. but whenever I used to go there, you know, once in a while. So mm. I never had a personal connection with, uh, with them. Uh, once the Charlie started, I think uh, the personal connection started once again with Charlie hmm. uh, because I was getting trained with her, then I was shooting with her and uh, uh, you know, off screen we used to have fun. Uh, so yeah, uh, Charlie in a way uh, you know, changed a lot of things inside me also. Oh, sweet. So yeah, uh, Sangeeta and Raj also said so something like they had just few scenes with Charlie that took so many takes out of great difficulty they did and also testing uh, their patience. But you had the screen space most of the time with Charlie and of course your patience would have been like I'm there, <laughs> gone. I am a very patient guy actually. Okay. But by the end of this film, I had learned <laughs> patience to the next level. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, have you lost it somewhere? You know I am leaving here. There is, there is one scene where I had lost. Uh, oh. Because, uh, I mean see, I, by the end of it, I had got gotten used to uh, the way we are shooting. Mm -mm -mm -mm. You know, every uh, shot you should take like 30-40 takes. Mm. Uh, because Charlie has to uh, perform mm. and uh, I had to give my best in every take because you don't know when Charlie will perform. Yes, uh, yes. So once Charlie performs, that take is okay. <laughs> so I, need, I, I had to give I, uh, you know, uh, best, my best in every take. Mm. Uh, a point where I probably you know, was like, no, no, enough is enough <laughs> kind of a feeling is uh. when th there was a scene where, you know, so in, in the film, uh, like you see in the trailer, uh, Charlie comes and wakes me up in the, every morning. Yes, you yes, know? Uh, yes. So we used to apply fish oil on the face and uh, so that it's, it can uh, smell it and come and uh, lick oh, my face okay. uh, so uh, that, uh, you know, that looks like, you know, she's licking my face uh, and wake, uh. Uh, waking me up. Mm. Uh, so there was one scene where you know, uh, we had used the other Charlie mm -hmm. because uh, in that scene, uh, the director wanted a lot of energy uh, in the in the dog, mm. uh, and uh, this Charlie is very papa. I mean, the the Charlie which is there in ninety percent of the film, okay. she is very uh, you know very innocent, oh. very pa very papa. So mm -hmm. she won't give that kind of an energy. Okay. So there's one more Charlie which we as used as actually a puppy. Mm. So by then, the, this puppy had grown to uh, uh, the present uh, the, the Charlie. Uh, oh. other Charlie's uh, size. Mm. So we uh, thought we'll use that uh, Charlie and okay. we you know applied the fish oil and she had to come and uh, mm -hmm. you know uh, lick my face mm. and uh, she is so energetic that she came she jumped on the court and she started licking mm -hmm. uh, my face but then there are there are like two three uh, her teeth marks on my uh, uh, on face, your face oh, sure. on my face yeah 
So I was like, okay, fine, the take is over. Uh, <laughs> what's done is done. So uh. let's let's cover that in makeup and uh, go forward. But the director was like, no, uh, you know, I want one more take. Oh, you? Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh. So then I was like, you know, okay, let's watch what we have shot. And okay. uh, I was like, the shot is fine. Why do you uh. want one more take? No, no, no. I wanted the dog to come from the left side, <laughs> not from the right side. <laughs> not from the right side. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I'm like, no, I'm not giving another take. Yeah. I just moved, uh, you know, got out of uh. the uh, set. And then I, you know, went out, uh, thought for some time, and then they were uh, still wondering if we should uh, go Continue for the next or shot. Or okay, uh, uh, uh. And then, then I went back and gave one mm. more take and finished it off. So yeah, so this uh, this is where like you lost patience, and of course, if at all, I saw another interview like uh, you were not ready for Charlie too. I mean, <laughs> like if at all, for your taking means so. But if chance, you will accept the Charlie two chance. Part two, no, chapter two, no, no. never. <laughs> See, Charlie one happened when I uh, when I didn't know what is the challenge. Okay. okay so uh, uh, you are un when you are unaware of the challenge, you are like, okay, fine, let's let's do it. Mm -hmm. But now I know how difficult it is to shoot with uh, a dog. I mean, you never know. So yeah, uh, yeah. After probably right now, I have plans for uh, already have plans for three four years. Mm -hmm. So once I finish that, and then probably you know. Uh, I might be in a state where okay, let's see the let's challenge once it. again. Yeah. Yeah. But so right now, if you ask me, no. No. <laughs> no. Okay. So one thing is like uh, the scenes, shots, or it's Charlie is that you have to do multitasking. You have to hear commands from this side, or so many things going around this side, and you'll have treats. And we also, also Sangeeta also told the same. So how much difficult it was it like uh, to bring out the emotion from Charlie? Oh, that was uh, completely Kiran Raj's uh, job. <laughs> uh, I mean, he was so particular about few emotions. Mm -hmm. He used to go to the workshop when she she, she was mm -hmm. getting trained, and then he used to capture there with the, uh, with his phone. Mm -hmm. And there he used to get few expressions, like you know, uh, out of the blue, mm -hmm. she would give few ex uh, few expressions, and he would have captured it, and then he would have uh, gone home, and he would have seen uh, through those expressions, okay. and. Uh, he would have come to the set and asked for the same expression uh, uh, once again. Oh, how do you get that expression <laughs> from a dog? Uh, but somehow, you know, mm. he used to wait, he used to wait, mm -hmm. we used to shoot, uh, you know. Uh, there are days when we have shot just one shot mm -hmm. because he wanted one particular expression from Charlie. Yeah, he told us actually, uh -huh. so that, that was very difficult, right? Uh -huh. So that, that that was very difficult, of course. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, uh, it was not a, you know, not an easy job. See, look, look at her, the way she is looking at the <laughs> camera. Uh, I mean, <laughs> there is so much of innocence, uh, uh, you know, right uh, in the eye, the way yes. it is looking. But it is that naughty as well. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, uh, we, we, we gave our best and yes, uh, things yes, turned yes. out well. So, one of the best scenes from the trailer, like uh, how many times we have seen it, I'll sit and cry or audience also sat and cried. Uh, the La end the part of yes, yeah yes. so that emotion how did you uh, how did it just happen see when when you look at uh, the screen it looks very uh, emotional uh, right? emotional mm. oh, uh, you know that kind of an expression yes yes but shooting it was not that easy okay. uh, uh, in the sense every time it has to jump uh, mm. you know to hug me mm -hmm. so basically it is uh, you know following a command when it when it when it jumps sometimes it you know keeps both hands here mm -hmm. Sometimes it keeps both hands here, so it keeps changing, and and uh, you know her her both both the uh, legs it, it just crosses my face like that, uh, you know as if she's giving one ninja uh, punch, <laughs> punch, and then she uh -uh. she keeps the uh, hand like that. Uh -huh. uh, so you know there are chances when uh, there are chances that you know her her nails just might scratch over my face, and that has happened a lot of times. Oh my god! Uh, not in that scene, but uh -huh. uh, a lot of times. You know, uh, after every day shoot, when I used to go and open, uh, you know, my ch change my clothes, I used to have uh, scratch marks all over, all over the body. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, but yeah, it's, you know, today everything looks nice. Yes. So yeah, uh, the thing is like uh, we can see Dharma and uh, Charlie have a beautiful companionship. In reality, Rakshit Shetty has got a, a, a shoulder to lean on. Means who it is? Shoulder to lean on when I have problems. To be frank, mm. I uh, I like to be alone and you know face it by myself. Okay. Uh, I that's how I am. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but yeah, the, uh, you know when it comes to Charlie, the bonding had developed so much that I am. I am to be frank, I am very detached. Uh, you know from everything. Uh, that's how I am. Uh, but Charlie, uh, I had got gotten used to Charlie so much that 
uh, during the pandemic and all, uh, you know, she used to stay in Mysore. I used to stay in ba uh, Bangalore. Mm. So I used mm -hmm. to call the the trainer and ask him that you know uh, when are you getting to her to Bangalore. Mm. So I I remember doing that, but at the same time I'm like you know this is not me. <laughs> I was not <laughs> like this before. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, so yeah, so there are small changes which has happened because of Charlie. Okay, so not small changes actually. Vast big, changes. Yeah. So like uh, from. Being alone to like okay, let me have some companion. No, I'm oh. not. I mean, uh, it's not being alone. Uh -huh. uh, it's like it's just that I enjoy my uh, own, lo space, lonely yes. own space. Yeah. Okay, sweet. Uh, so one thing is that uh, Tamil audience started accepting pan Indian films, and in recent times they they were like appreciating like uh, please take uh, stories like this, and also uh, in Tamil audience like one thing like they felt very bad is that. Uh, when other p other languages are giving a uh, best of stories and why not Tamil audience? Mm. So how do you see this? Oh, I uh, I think Tamil has been producing great films, mm -hmm. uh, not just now but uh, uh, you know for a long time. But it's it's all we you know we uh, we we always do that that uh, you know we always ignore our. Uh, we always like uh, when uh, when, when good it is things something is, when yeah. good things come from uh, you know other industry <laughs> yes. and uh, when good things come from our industry we always ha huh, this is always coming no it's okay mm. so that we ignore mm. uh, so that is that is i think normal uh, human behavior but otherwise i believe uh, you know uh, tamil also has been giving great films okay yeah so being a pan indian film uh, do you think it is an added responsibility or do you have any fear on yourself like uh, that will reach to a certain extent or because uh, in recent times uh, reviews also plays a major role and it sometimes outbashes a film or outbashes even a character or a hero so how do you see this i i, I don't see it that way mm -hmm. uh, see, see, one thing is that we are very confident about the film mm -hmm. uh, so uh, irrespective of it doing well in box office or not uh, people whoever watch you know people will know that it's a good film mm. and if it uh, didn't uh, if, it, if it doesn't do well uh, then you know they will say that okay it was a good film but didn't do well for some certain reasons yes uh, so i don't see it as a uh, that uh, uh, it will backlash or uh, something like that. Okay. I think everything happens for good and uh, you know, give your best uh, and see what happens. Yes. So, you've been exploring cinema and you've been in all aspects of cinema. So, what is your next plan in cine industry? Like, let me try this. Uh, so, I want to try uh, mythology. Uh, that is something which uh, uh, I crave for, you know, to try that genre. Mm. Uh, so I have a couple of films to finish and probably I'll, I'll, I'll do one mythological subject soon. Okay, since uh, I mean like you are into like so much of creativity, uh, I saw a random comment in Twitter like uh, will you become a lyricist by any chance? I have written... Uh, no, like in recent times after this. Ah, so la in last 4-5 uh, uh, years I have not written yes, uh, yes. lyrics for any film. Yes. Uh, uh, but obviously, you know, probably uh, whenever there is a chance, whenever, see, uh, um, I sh ex started exploring lyrics uh, because I wanted to uh, bring certain philosophy in, in the song, uh, you know, of Ulidur Kandante. Mm -hmm. And uh, nobody, when I, if I, I can't ask someone to, uh, you know, what is there in my mind has had to come. Yes. So, uh, so uh, you know, it just happened in Ulidur Kandante and I wrote th uh, three songs in mm. that film. And then that became a habit and I wrote three songs in Creek Party yes. and one, ro one song in uh, Godi Varna Sarana mm. Vikattu. Uh, but then after that in ASN, I didn't feel li like mm. writing anything. Uh, in Charlie also, I, uh, you know, uh, I didn't feel like, uh, mm. you know, uh, writing anything uh, because if, if I write, then the, it has to be, uh, the philosophy has to be, you know, yes. uh, which, I, which I relate to. Mm -hmm. And uh, so probably uh, in the future projects, definitely, especially when I, I direct, I'm sure there will be one or two songs which I'll write. Oh, wow. So, looking forward for that. And yeah, uh, one more thing is like, I saw a few comments uh, here and there, like most of the repeated comments is that uh, Rakshit Chetty is a genius and he's mean underrated in this industry. Mm. So, how do you see this comment? Uh, I'm. I don't know if, if I'm <laughs> underrated because see, as long as I, all um, all I am concerned about is that as long as uh, I have a market to do my next film, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, I have I uh, and because of that market, I get a uh, certain budget to mm -hmm. do the, to do that film. Mm -hmm. I'm happy, mm -hmm. and uh, so I'm I'm in a position where I'm 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 able to uh, produce and uh, act in films. So that is the biggest uh, the best life I can have. So, I am happy about that already. Okay. So, we have seen Rakshat Shetty exploring all of cinema and everything like Rakshat Shetty knows everything. But when it comes to personal life, uh, I mean like you are all alone. 
So everybody questions like, when is your that's, marriage? It's, it's beautiful to be alone. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you know, if you actually enjoy it, uh, mm -hmm. there are a lot of things. Uh, you know, uh, you can actually sit and question yourself about a lot of things and uh, understand life in a in a certain way. Mm -hmm. And uh, see, uh, I'm not alone because uh, I write. And okay. when you're when you're uh, writing, you are creating a world uh, which is yours. Mm -hmm. And uh, you're creating characters and experiencing characters. I mean, to write characters, you have to experience mm -hmm. them. Uh, and uh, you know. That is like you know I have al I already have so many friends there, <laughs> uh, but even otherwise I'm uh, you know I have other friends also with okay. whom I do go and interact with. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, but yeah, the, uh, if you are asking marriage, then marriage uh, is you know we don't live to uh, yes. marry, yes. Uh, and marriage happens. Mm -hmm. uh, it's not that it is not compulsory also to get uh, get married, but uh, sometimes life brings. See, I see life in a certain way that uh, if. If life has to give you certain experience, it will mm -hmm. give. Uh, yes. You know, it has to give, and uh, I believe marriage happens when uh, at the right time. Wow, so sweet and well said. So before we wind up, do you want to say something to your audience, like Tamil audience especially? They just uh, started accepting you, so yeah. One thing I can guarantee is that uh, you should watch this film in theater, mm -hmm. and uh, my guarantee is that if you watch it, the experience what you have. Uh, it will be very unique, uh, which you have not had in with any film. Uh, you know, uh, by the end of it, you are smiling, you are crying. Uh, and at the same time, you are taken uh, to a very surreal world, and uh, uh, it, it's it's a very divine experience. So, uh, and for that, you know, you should experience it with the sound design, uh, the, uh, the, the mu music. What uh, Nobin has. Uh, uh, you know, um, uh, constructed and uh, you know the kind of visuals what uh, will come on screen. Uh, you know that experience. I think you should have in theater. So uh, don't miss it in theater. So I wish you all the very best and more of exploration in the cinema. Thank you. So thank, thank you so, so much. much. Thank you. Thank you.